Hey everybody, welcome back to another episode of Final Fantasy X. Let's continue right where we left off and let's run forward and see. We just had a little cutscene here, so that's where we left off. Let's go ahead and see what happens next. I swear I saw something on my screen, but I didn't I didn't I don't know. Let's make sure we don't miss any chests in here. Okay, first encounter at this cave. So these are new. Okay, let's... What can I steal from them? 17,000. And they're weak to fire. Soul Spring, okay. Um, they're weak to fire. I don't have the level 3 fire on Yuna. Oh, well. That 3.5k 3, 3. is still enough. Um, I could probably beat it if I just like you know, played super, super smart, but I also probably just want to grind it out eventually. Ooh. The heck is that? It, other than um, Demi, it didn't really do much, so. Okay. Not bad, not bad, I guess. Oh, there's a safe station right there, I'm not gonna heal. Right, let's go ahead and do a little saber rule here. And let's keep going. Um, hmm. Watch down here first. Does it, does it matter which way I go? Ooh, another new enemy. Okay. What are you weak to? Fair enough. Yeah, it wasn't super hard. Maybe we're not like as far back in the game as I thought we were, but at the same time, it was hitting me pretty good. So I don't, I don't know. I guess we'll see in the next boss fight here. Go down there. I think it might be going in the Ooh, robot. Yeah, like I said, I kind of want to just keep continuing the game, but I also know I should probably grind before the end of the game. But we'll see. Looks like we got a job to do, yeah? If anything should happen in the water, we're relying on you three. If it gets dangerous, pull out quick. Right. Be careful, okay? Okay, okay. Let's go ahead and continue now that we've kind of seen that we can't really do anything in that other place. I see something in the corner there. So let's go this way first. Okay. Water creatures. And that's fine. Use grenades? I think a grenade will be a good idea here. I'm surprised grenades work underwater, but hey, fair enough. Mm. 
even with us in the water. Okay. Fair enough. Is there anything down here? Oh, there is. Okay. Nothing I can do, though. Okay. What over here? Another encounter? Okay, we got two of those things and now a school of fish. Alright, let's see. We're back on land. What the heck is that? Aim for the center with Waka's ball. Okay. Let's hit it on the next way around. Okay, I didn't realize how what was the Okay, so based on that right there. Easy. Oh, but I gotta get, avoid that second trap. Did I miss? Oh, now I just threw randomly. Okay, David, slow, slow yourself down, buddy. Now. Easy. Okay. A little key sphere. Oh, that reminds me. Let's probably do some customization. Let's see. I wonder if there's a better sword that I could put on... Um... My Titus here. What? And then I guess we could put, if we could do that, I guess we could put, see, first strike, I actually don't actually want the first strike because I probably want my magic guys going. We could put these two and call it a day because none of this would really be useful here. Okay, then let's just put this and this. Okay, and that'll work. Yeah, I'll use this. Then, now, I don't actually know where to go, so I guess we gotta figure it out. Can I go underwater? Okay, so I walked back, and now there's a red thing here, so this is where I'm gonna go. <gasps> Did me hitting that thing with the ball open up a new path? Is that what's going on? That one makes sense. Okay, I was wondering, I'm like, was that all just for a chest? That makes more sense. Okay, well, let's continue on here. Um, now that we have this open, right. it, there's no reason for me to fight things right now. Alright, let's take this path first. Not gonna let us. Okay. Fair enough. Then this. Then I take this path then. Where does this take us? Oh, we get the uh, first strike. Grind. I'm gonna grind on my own. I don't want to like sit here and fight things on camera. No particular reason to do so. There's a lot of enemies in this place now. Of course, I have like other things to do that, but hey. Works, it works. A lot of water. A lot of encounters, too. I have like 99 of them after we get out of this cave, but I think that's fair enough. What is this? Hit the three panels simultaneously. Check each size before deciding. Check each size before deciding who to send. No. 
Okay, then Riku definitely goes in the green one. You go in the blue one. And Waka goes in the red one. For sure here. Correct? Correct. Okay, well yeah, let's go underwater and get that chest here. Fortune Sphere. Okay. Well, considering now we got that trial done, that should mean that uh, one of the other, you know, something opened up for us. So, we're going to go ahead and uh, see what opened up here for us. This opened up. Okay, okay. I was wondering, I was like, where, where, where did something open up? But that makes sense, it opened up right Because I thought we would be able to go there. Confirmed it. Go up. They'll be upon us soon. True. She has sent fiends to test our summoner's strength. Who is she? Unaleska. Who that? Lady Unaleska. Oh, if we've heard of her. Anakin, she awaits the arrival of the strongest. She is still alive? As much as Micah and Seymour. I see. Lost your nerve? No. Nothing frightens me now. <laughs> Braska would be proud. Then I must not let him down. Let's move forward. There's a safe station right there. I'm gonna go ahead and, uh... A little save a here. I might do some grinding before the next episode, so maybe when we get, you know, because we're, you know, we're fairly close to the end of the game here. I'm pretty sure everyone knows that's pretty obvious. So, um, do maybe grinding before, so when I get to the final portions of the game, I'm not, you know, extremely weak or anything. Um, but this episode hasn't felt done yet because we haven't done anything other than walk through a cave so this this one's i'm not gonna end here i like that enemy by the way i think it's a cool looking enemy i wonder is the boss fight now or do we keep going i guess let's see it comes it comes is that a dragon is that looks like something i can beat sanction 40k that 40k is not a lot wait what is it week two again i already forgot uh black oh it doesn't high physical and magic defense okay well let's see how high it really is that is pretty high actually then let's go ahead and bring in kamari um, lowers magic defense. We need to lower its magic defense because we're gonna start casting spells on it. Photon rings. That sounds like it hurts. Can we silence this? Is that a thing we can do? Immune. Oh, did I just screw myself over? Oh, he's just gonna bite Kamari. Um, let's go ahead and bring Riku in here. I can't have people being asleep and dark, so. Does Albed fix sleep? Albed does not fix sleep. Fair enough. Let's go ahead and bring Orin. We can use another. Can we lower its magic twice? I never thought of that. Um. Wait. No. We need to wake up Yuna, but for now, I just want to see. How strong this can we poison it also we should learn if we can poison it because if we can poison it that would help tail sweep is this please wake up yuna now yuna is awake oh and it's gonna bite lulu but it missed because it's bad okay now this should be able to hit it four or five k hopefully four k that's what i'd like to see man um rats not good oh but it's only on you know. Uh, 
this is super super risky i just i really want to poison it and then i want to heal but i want to don't be mean good i want as many turns as possible for it to get hit by that poison so i want to do it really i should have done it a lot earlier on but that's all right gonna bring up you now please give me one more turn oh that just heals itself okay fair enough um a bed potion um i want to poison it again hmm bring waka into here um Dark? Can we dark it? That way, when it does its physical attacks, it won't. Oh, it didn't get dark. Okay, well, let's just hit it with some more magic here. What more can we do? It does a lot of damage, so I want to hit it with that as much as humanly possible. Oh, that's a lot of healing. Okay, well then, we're going to get poisoned again. So you'll have to waste a turn using it, uh, the, that Asuna. Yeah, so if we just poison it, it'll have to waste an entire turn just to get that off. So, Tail Sweep. I know it does a thousand, and I missed on two people, but it's terrible. Okay, I don't want to use that. Let's go ahead and switch out for Titus. Let's get Titus in here. Um, does this work? Does Delay Buster work on this thing? If, no, it doesn't. Okay, that was a bad idea. Now everyone's going to get hit. Oh, but Titus can actually heal, so that's okay. Although, it's not his turn anymore, so... And everyone's down bad. Uh, bring Riku in here. Use... The All Bad Potion will get rid of the Silence and Darkness. It won't get rid of the Confusion, though, which is bad. Oh, it doesn't get rid of the Darkness, actually. Okay. Um, how much... You know what? I'm just gonna do it. I can't Grand Summon. Eh. Okay, well, I don't need a grand summon, I guess. Let's just uh, use a blizzard and call it a day. Should be under half now. What it. Ow? Yeah, that's right, get poisoned. Use an all bed potion, make sure we're not in any danger here. Um. Let's get Orin in here. Maybe... I wonder if any of the triple foul things can hit it. Tail sweep. Okay, it only does mist on literally everyone. You're absolutely garbage. Let's do another Blizzaga. Apparently, if you're dark, you can't summon, or is there something else on it? I, is Titus still confused? Why is Titus still confused, guys? Snap out of it. Dude, that poison is doing some work, though. I'm not gonna lie. That's 2k a turn. And it, ha and it hasn't taken the time to get rid of the debuff yet. Oh, that hurts. And Titus is still not alive. I really wish he'd be... I might use a remedy before I kill this thing, maybe. Don't do that. Okay, finally used that to heal itself. But, see, it, wait it had to use that turn. Now it's dead. Dude, is Titus gonna get the experience for this? Cause he's confused. I wonder. Yeah, that fight wasn't hard. There's gonna be something harder, I guarantee you, because that fight was not hard. It didn't do anything spectacular, and it didn't it didn't have one shot capabilities. It didn't even have, it didn't even have two shot capabilities. Hey, can't we rest a little? No need. We reach the summit soon. I know. That's why I want to stop for a bit. Soon means that there's not much time left. Riku. Fine. I'll think on the way. Oh, Titus did get it. Okay. We'd love to see it. Hey, come on, let's go. We are. We're almost there, aren't we? Mm. We've come a long way. <laughs> What's so funny? 
You remind me of myself. Before, the closer I came to Xanarkand, the more I wondered. When we arrive, Brasco will call the final Aeon. He will fight Sin, then die. I thought my mind was made up long before. But when I stood here, my resolve wavered. Hmm. Never would have figured. Legendary Guardians choke sometimes too, yeah? <laughs> Legendary Guardian. I was just a boy. A boy about your age, actually. I wanted to change the world, too. But I changed nothing. That is my story. Sad. Um, let's go, I guess. Let's reach the top. I wouldn't want to end the episode off here. Oh, I didn't heal. A city dead for a thousand years. A city I had to see with my own eyes. The end of Yuna's journey. The last chapter in my story. My thoughts, they kept floating up and then slipping through my fingers. Slipping away before I could pin them down with words. Yuna, I say no. If we go down there, then you'll... Riku. You're a true friend, and I thank you, but I must go down to Sanarkand. I'm not saying we shouldn't go, but should we think about it some more? There's got to be some kind of way we can save you, Yuna! All my life, I knew this moment would come. Thank you, Riku. Thank you for everything. Don't say that, Yuni. It's not over yet. Tell Sid, thank you. No, you can tell him yourself. Say that because we're gonna see each other again, okay? Jamari, let's go. Sir Oren, Kimari told me, when my father wanted me taken from Bavel to Besaid, it was you who told Kimari, right? I had always wanted to meet you someday. I am truly glad that I had that chance. Having you as a guardian was so great an honor. I don't know how to thank you. Perhaps if I defeat Sin, that will be my thanks to you. That's what I'll do. Yes. I will challenge Sin. I will defeat Sin. If you are all there watching this, then I guess Sin is already gone. And so am I. I suppose. <laughs> anyway, I just wanted to say, Sir Oren, I thank you. 
Kimari. <laughs> Do you remember the first day we met? I was only seven. My father had defeated Sin, and all Pavel was celebrating. Everyone was saying what a hero my father was. I was so happy. But when night came, it occurred to me. My father had defeated Sin, and now he was dead. Now I was all alone. I couldn't sleep. So I wandered into the town, away from the celebrating crowds. I stood on the bridge in Bevel, where my father and I had parted. Standing there, alone, I could see the fields where he had fought Sin. Then, you appeared, Kamari. You said you were looking for the daughter of Braska, remember? At first, I was so scared until I realized what a gentle person you are. <laughs> you weren't used to talking to children. When I told you that I was Braska's daughter, you said you would take me as far from Bevel as you could. That it was the wish of a man facing death. I think I cried then because that that was when I knew my father was dead, and I would never see him again. You just held me, without saying a word. I cried after we got to Besaid, too. When you tried to go, after leaving me in the care of the temple, I held on to you crying, don't go, don't go. And you listened, Kimari. You stayed. Kimari, thank you. Thank you so much. And I've always liked your broken horn. Waka, Lulu. I'll never forget my days spent with you, growing up in Besaid. We always played together, us and Chapu. That's why I was always so happy, I think. And when you refused to let me become a summoner, and I did it anyway. I'm sorry. I've always wanted to apologize. You know, when you tried to stop me then, really, I was happy. I could tell you really cared about me. You were like my big brother and sister. No, I think you really were my big brother and sister. What else? <laughs> I love watching you play Blitzball, Waka. <laughs> I even love it when you scold me, Lulu. <laughs> really. I guess that leaves the newest guardian. Star player of the Xanarkand Abes. You are... known each other that long, but it's funny. So, so this is what it feels like. It's a much more wonderful feeling than anything I had ever imagined. Wonderful. But it hurts sometimes. Hmm. Hmm. I wonder. I, <laughs> I just want to say Thank you for everything. <laughs> maybe... Maybe that's why it hurts. When I... When I think about us never being together again at all... I'm afraid. <laughs> no, I shouldn't say that. I'll do that part over. Um... What you up to?
Okay. Um, can I think, I, I don't know if there's a save station up there, but if there's not a long, long cutscene, cut I have to end the episode right here, so I, I guess I'll just do it, guys. Thanks for watching. If you did enjoy, make sure to like and comment as well as the channel, and I'll see you guys later. God bless, and goodbye.